Okay, we've got a progression from the sit video where we first started working on getting the dog to sit. So in the first video, the aim, let me, the aim was just to get the dog to put a bum on the floor. And when she did that, the instant she did that, we were rewarding it. Now we're not mentioning the word sit or anything else at this moment in time. All we were looking for is the dog's bum on the floor. Now we're going to progress from that a little bit. Um, and I, I, have, I have progressed anyway during my own training, not on film, with me. Um, so what I want to do now is encourage the dog, whilst she's sitting, to give me eye contact. So now she knows to sit, she's not gonna get that reward, I'm not gonna give her the marker until I get eye contact. But the very second I do, she's gonna get it. What I'm also trying to encourage is I want her sitting in front of me. Um, and that's gonna help later down the line when I do retrieves or recall, because when I do a recall, I want to sat right in front of me. So if I can encourage that now and embed that now, that when I sit, it should be in front of daddy, in future, half the job's done for me. Um, what I'm gonna do, every time she sits, I'm gonna break her out of the sit, just by walking forward. That'll get her up, and then I'm gonna step back, which should hopefully pull her into me, and bring her towards me, and then she'll sit again. And I'm just gonna do, repetition to that like I do every other time when, when she's eating food and uh, hopefully within a week or two it'll go in and then we can progress from there a little bit further if she's good with her eye contact which she tends to be what I want to avoid her doing is looking at my hand with the food in it I want to look at my eyes knowing that if I look at his eyes I get the food so as she gets better I'm gonna gradually move the food bowl and the food in my hand further out of her range of vision, so she's still got to look there. Now it's quite easy with this dog because her eyes aren't dark, but with my other dog she's jet black and her eyes are black as well, so it's really difficult. But you stick with it, just do three or four at a time to try and get eye contact. Loads and loads of continual repetitions and you'll get there in the end. Waiting for that eye contact until I reward with the good. Good. And she's she's really good for eye contact anyway, but she's such a quick learner compared to the other one. Good. progression every single uh, time you do it always aim to get closer to the ultimate picture but never rush it if she wasn't achieving that then I'd just go back to step one and just repeat step one over and over and over and over and over until we get to, to the point where I feel comfortable where I can get on to step two so never rush little small steps and you'll get great results eventually and there's no rush with that